Hello guys, in this video I'll be talking about fate of a carbocation. So when one carbocation is formed, how can it can uh, react with uh, nucleophiles or deprotonation or rearrangement like pinnacle rearrangement involves carbocation formation or if you again deprotonate another proton from this you will get alkenes or nucleophiles most common method is the carbocation are being attacked by a nucleophile so you get a nucleophilic product such as alcohols ethers or it's very common in carbonyl compounds where you get a positive charge on carbonyl carbon which gets a carbocationic uh, shape that's why they are being attacked by a nucleophile so in short when you have a carbocation it can either go a nucleophilic attack or it can either go deprotonation or it can undergo rearrangement so these are three fit of carbocations that you need to know when you get a carbocation you need to think about these three situations that might happen with the carbocation thanks for watching more videos will be available about carbocations in following series bye